Hi folks, it is time for science. So this is your agenda and screencast for Wednesday, April 8th. We're going to continue learning about the digestive system and kind of continue along the same deal that we had on Monday. You'll be taking a little uh, section of notes, you'll watch another crash course with some questions, and you'll continue working on that Big Mac attack assignment. As usual, you still have a question for the attendance quiz, so let's go ahead and take a look at that in Schoology. So we're going to go to Schoology, and it's under our week of four, six materials. When we take a look, this is in uh, chronological order, so you'll take a look. Here's your attendance question, just a quick check-in. How are you doing? And let's jump into the assignment. As we continue the digestive system, you will continue your notes. So if you take a look at the notes that you started from Monday, you should have 15.1 through 15.4 completed. In this part, we are going to be doing the stomach, the pancreas, and the liver. So once you get done with the liver, which is section 15.8, call that good for today. And a lot of it is actually labeling. And those are going to be coming straight off of the PowerPoints from that uh, notes PowerPoint that is linked right here. During class time, I will be lecturing a little bit over that. So if you want to hear notes and have that sort of auditory learning, if that's useful to you, that will be available to you. The next thing will be watching the crash course. Again, this links straight to it. And then there is a document here that is your questions. Similar to the one from Monday, this is also only five questions, fill in the blank, and it also goes in the order of the video. So it should be fairly straightforward. Last thing is you're working on that Big Mac attack. On Monday, you started this assignment and did model one, questions one through six. You're now going to be working in model two in the nutrition facts and completing the questions that correspond with that. This time you have one more with seven questions, but you only need to worry about this section today. Obviously, there is more to see and more to think about, but we're not getting to that today. I will be helping answer questions and helping folks along if you are having troubles with the assignment, both during class and during office hours. So if you have questions or concerns, please reach out to me and I'm happy to help you. Otherwise, I hope that chunking this up is useful to you instead of trying to do one big thing at once, and rather that we're doing little bits of several things instead. Um, that's all I have for today. Make sure to get that attendance question done by 4 p.m. and then the crash course done by midnight. Remember that I'm not making you turn in your notes, but you will be able to use those on an open note quiz at the end of the unit. I hope you all have a great day. We'll see you next time. Bye.